Narcissists act differently when you're not there. Narcissists have at least two personalities, two different sides to them. They're like Dr. Jekyll and Mr. Hyde. They have two different ways of acting and behaving. They don't always express their genuine feelings. Instead, they deceive and mislead other people. They give them the wrong impression. They hide who they really are. They hide what they're really about. Because they're fake people, they're not real or genuine. They just pretend to have a feeling, emotion, illness or injury so that they can get what they want. The narcissist will show you whatever they think you want to see. They will display the selfless character who is concerned more with the needs and wishes of other people rather than with their own. Because they're using it to manipulate people into doing what they want. They will pretend to care about you. They will pretend to respect you. They will pretend to have their own values and morals. Because they have secretly studied you. They have studied your likes and dislikes. They have learned what you want to see. They have learned what you want to hear. And then they reflect it back to you. They present themselves as something that you might like or be interested in so that you're willing to invest your time, energy or money into them. And at first, it may seem like a good investment until a few months go by and then cracks begin to appear. Things start to go wrong. And you realize that it wasn't worth investing in after all. You're forced to accept that you've been tricked. You've been led to believe something that isn't true. Because the narcissist has to lie to you. They have to make up stories. They have to hide important information. Because otherwise you wouldn't want anything to do with them. You would never stick around. So instead, they show you everything you desire, everything you want to see. But as time goes by, you realize that there is another side to them, a side that is very different to everything you thought they were, everything that they displayed to you in the beginning. From what they had showed to you in the beginning, you never would have expected them to end up this way. But they were this way all along. They just hid that from you. They didn't reveal all of their problems and issues in the beginning. They withhold that information from you until you're locked in. Many narcissists have anger issues. Many of them are alcoholics or they have drug addictions. But these are things that they never revealed to you in the beginning. They did everything they could to hide that from you. Because they know that's not something desirable. They know that's not something to be proud of. They are very reckless. They are very foolish and careless. They don't consider the consequences of their actions. Which is how they're able to 
excessively indulge in alcohol, drugs and sex because they're not happy with their lives. So they engage in escapism. They seek distraction. Because they don't want to deal with reality. So how could they care about what is right or wrong? They will do anything to get what they want. Narcissists act differently when you're not there. Everything you thought they were is not who they really are. Everything you were led to believe is not real or genuine. It's an illusion. It's a facade. And they constructed a false character just to manipulate you. They don't really have any values or morals. They don't have any principles or standards of behavior. They don't have any judgment of what is important in life. And they haven't learned any lessons derived from stories or experiences because they never take accountability for anything anyway. It's always someone else's fault. Or it just happened by chance. Or they act like nothing is wrong. Because the truth is they don't really care about anyone or anything. That was just a false character that they used to lure you in. It wasn't real. You may think that you've gotten to know them. You've learned all of these things about them. And you know who they are and what they're about. But how can you be so sure? They displayed this character to you at the beginning. But that wasn't who they really are. So even this character you're seeing now may not be who they really are. There could be so much more to them that no one even knows. What you're seeing could only be the tip of the iceberg. There could be a much larger part that you are not seeing. Things that you do not know about. Things that you may never know. Because just remember what happened in the beginning. You got to know this character. And you thought that was who they really are. But then you soon discovered that it's not who they really are. You were just getting to know the false character. That was who you believed in. That was who you trusted. And you believe that you had this connection. You believe that you were in love with them. You developed expectations from a character that wasn't even real. A person who didn't even exist. But then you wonder why they're not capable of meeting those expectations. When that character was never real in the first place, it was just constructed to deceive you. You don't know who they really are. And you may never know. You don't know what they're doing when you're not there. Maybe they're giving that same character to someone else. But one thing is for sure, when the narcissist is not around you, they're up to no good. They're doing something bad. They're doing something that is not good for you. Because they don't care about you. They never did and they never will. This kind, caring person you thought you knew doesn't even exist. 
They just reflected your qualities and ideals back to you. They knew who you wanted them to be. But they were never about any of that. It was just a trap. So that they could get what they want from you. Which is why once they've gotten what they wanted. That kind, caring character you saw at the beginning. Is now nowhere to be found. But you still feel like you have a connection with the false character. You feel like you want to be with them. But you need to accept that this character doesn't even exist. You fell for something that wasn't even real. It was an act. They behaved in the way that you desired and expected. So that you kept them around. But they act differently when you're not there. They will give people whatever they want to see. Whatever will get them attention. Because that's all they really care about. That's where they created the false character. It wasn't to share anything with you. It was designed to trick you. Into giving your attention to them. Something they know they're not worthy or deserving of. Which is why they knew they had to create a false character. They knew they had to lie to you. They knew they had to hide important information from you. They knew they had to play you for a fool. Because that was the only way that they could get in. If they were upfront about who they are. And what they're really about. You never would have kept them around. And they know that. They created the false character. Because they knew that you would never accept who they really are. Thank you for watching. I hope this video resonated with you. Please like, comment, share and subscribe. If you would like to donate, my PayPal link is in the video description. Coach inquiries, you can email me at coachingandarcsurvivor.co.uk Thank you for watching and I'll talk to you soon.